Hey guys, it's Brandon Miniman from PocketNow.com, and in this video we're going to take a look at the Windows Mobile Application Store done by Handango. It's called InHand, and it's actually been around for a while now, but most people don't talk about it. Most devices don't come with the program pre-installed, although the Sony Ericsson Xperia X1 will have it, so I thought it would be kind of cool to take a look at InHand and see how it does for an application store. Now, I've already installed the program, so I'm going to go into the Start menu, go to Programs, and click on InHand right here. Now this program tries to be a bit more than just a application store. It also lets you get to the weather, see some traffic with real-time traffic data, and even see a report on stocks. It's trying to be kind of a hub for all kinds of information, but I'm going to focus on just the application store aspect of this. So this is the kind of main screen. It's not too flashy. It's kind of ugly. The good thing about this whole interface, and you're going to see that it's, it's not flashy at all throughout, uh, is that it's fast. Which is, which is a really important thing to have in an application store. So I'm going to start off, I'm going to go right into software. And here's what we get. We get a menu. So we can go to best sellers, recommended, what's new. We can go by category. So I'm just going to start off at best sellers and click on there. And we get a list. And the list is simple. We don't get the entire catalog of Handango software for Windows Mobile, um, but just certain ones, although you can search through the whole catalog to find the software that you want. Um, you don't get to see ratings on the screen like you can in the iPhone application store. Um, if we want to find out more information about a particular title, we just tap on it. We'll get a rating, which is good, although I'm not sure if this is five stars out of five stars or five out of six. It doesn't really tell you that. And then it tells you a little description. You can also go on to click screenshots and it'll download them from the Handango server, which is kind of nice. You can see an animated screenshot um, that will go through different screens of the program. Now, unfortunately, there is not a trial functionality, so you can't download a trial, although with the iPhone application store, you can't do that either. If you go to Handango's website, you can get a trial of pretty much any piece of Windows Mobile software, so it's unfortunate that they didn't port this over to the um, in-hand application. Okay, now I'm going to take you to, through the process of actually buying a piece of software. I have this hooked up to my Handango account on, on the computer, and it has my credit card information in there. So, just like the iPhone, you can instantly download applications just as long as you log in. So, I'm going to search. I'm going to go into software, and I'm going to search for chess. I'm going to get an inexpensive chess game just so I can demonstrate. I'm going to do search. I'm just going to do proceed. I'm over an EVDO connection right now, so it's pretty fast. And I'm just going to go to the first one I see here. These are all the chess programs. It's called Rampart Chess. I'm going to click Buy, and I'm going to cut out for a minute as I log in. Okay, so here we are, and I'm covering up the screen just so for security reasons. Um, from here, we can press Continue, and you can enter a promotion code if you have a coupon or a 10% off code or something like that. I'm going to click Continue, and it's doing an order verification. It's purchasing right now. And it says, do you agree to pay this price? It's $12.95, and I'm going to say, I agree. Now, it's important to note that Windows Mobile applications are more expensive than those on the iPhone platform, and that's because the stores like Handango and Pocket Gear take a higher percentage from developers, so they have to price the applications higher. Uh, hopefully, this will change in the future if, if Microsoft comes out with a Sky Market platform to deliver um, mobile software and, and charge a lower percentage, but you should expect that if you're going to get premium software for Windows Mobile, it's going to be more expensive. Okay, so here I am now, no software activation required, and I'm going to click download now, and you're going to see it downloads pretty fast. And you can't do simultaneous downloads, unfortunately, from Handango in hand. But that said, the downloads are very quick, faster than they are on the iPhone, because I think the applications are a little bit smaller in most cases. So it automatically launches the file and starts to install it, which is great. Seamless experience. Okay, and it's done. And now I can exit the program, or I can just go right into the Programs menu and find the application. I think it's going to be listed up in... It's an email message. It's going to be listed up in Games. And yep, there it is, Rampart Chess. And here we are. We're done. So Handango in hand is a really good piece of software, actually. It's very fast. It's a seamless experience. It lets you search for software, pay for it, download it, and install it all within a few minutes. Uh, the only trouble is that the, the interface isn't very good looking as it is in the App Store on the iPhone. Now you can get the software by going to handango.com slash client. 
and from there you'll be able to download uh, the software directly to your phone through an SMS or you can uh, use the, the, the installer for your desktop. Now I should note that I tried to get this to work on the HTC Touch Pro but unfortunately it wasn't listed in the list of compatible devices for some reason nor was the HTC Touch Diamond so I think Handango needs to update their list um, but as you can see here, see here I'm using the Verizon VX6900 and it works just fine and I'm sure it will on any other QVGA Windows Mobile touchscreen device and it also works on Windows Mobile standard non-touch screen. So that's it for now.